Now here's the hub from the same engine. Um, we've just seen how bad a condition the clutch cage was in. Uh, this is the hub. Um, some of the steel pictures I showed earlier on showed this hub uh, having been taken out of the main clutch assembly in the middle and this is the gummed up clutch plate or pasted up clutch plate which is uh, completely polluted with its own burnt off, its own worn off, not really burnt off, uh, friction material. So you can see actually it's just made a black paste, uh, horrible black paste that uh, has coated the facer here. And it's, it's got everywhere as I've handled it over the time. Um, so that was the friction lining that ran against the uh, aluminium of the hub there. Uh, now, I think this is not the right plate for that position. Uh, I think it should be a plate like this with a much larger centre. Um, and the reason being that goes against there and within this plate goes a, uh, a metal ring and then a spring. This is actually a spring believe it or not. It's a conical spring, large diameter and it sits on there. These two both sit on the these two both sit on the hub. Well, they would if I get them to go down. Um, there we are. That way up. And this clutch plate goes round the outside. So this, this spring is actually just standing proud of the face of the clutch plate there. And this is the anti judder spring. And so as the pressure plate compresses the whole pack of plates together, um, this spring stops this last plate uh, being finally nipped up. And this is, uh, the fact that this is missing is probably this owner's um, cause of uh, the very very late clutch bite point and a very short clutch bite point at the lever as well. Somebody's clearly been into this clutch before me uh, and I think they've removed this in the false belief that that was causing the problem with the vibration while riding, the uh, vibration while taking off and um, they've taken that out for some reason. And um, of course it's led to this, uh, the bike's had all the same problems, plus it's acquired this problem of a very short bite point and a very late bite point. Uh, you can appreciate, I know this spring doesn't stand proud of there very much, but in terms of uh, movement at the clutch lever, uh, that probably represents, that, that just that standing proud there probably represents a further quarter of an inch. So the clutch pack has um, effectively, the um, the quarter inch uh, giving it which the quarter inch lever movement giving it that was there at the lever without this in and it's now acquired another quarter now that's back in so you've probably got a half inch or to an inch movement of lever um, so you'll have a much less uh, sharp takeoff and the bite point will be earlier because the plates the other plates will start to come together earlier because this spring is pushing against them so that is a damper within the clutch unit to make the clutch pack slightly springy actually and smooth the take up and uh, improve the feel of the clutch overall all bikes have that in uh, many people don't realize what it does and um, if you buy any aftermarket clutch packs uh, often that spring and this special plate aren't included um, they just sell you the normal plate so uh, it's very important to retain that or have that in good and have that in good working order so uh, i hope that uh, explains that okay um, i'll just show you the oil holes in this um, as well see here there are holes through from the inside and they're all slightly different distances from the face so this oil hole here is responsible for lubricating the steel plate that goes there uh, likewise that oil hole for lubricating the steel plate there and the problem for the plate that was here tight up against is that uh, this oil hole is nowhere near close enough to that end ironically it is the only groove on the inside of the on the inside of the uh, hub which uh, shares an oil hole for the outer steel plate as well um, so that was why the uh, first plate in particular that was in the wrong plate was getting all gummed up because that side of it sorry it was getting all gummed up because uh, the oil wash effect wasn't there to keep this cleaned out um, so I hope that uh, answers the problem and uh, with the correct set of springs, uh, with the correct um, anti judder uh, plate fitted, um, it should be okay. So I have a, se <coughs> have a selection of different springs 
different colour codes on them to uh, experiment and uh, get this uh, get this looks behaving itself for this uh, particular owner and uh, with a bit of luck it will be thrilled to bits. Thanks very much.